Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, as you can see, I have not moved out yet. We are moving tomorrow. So this is the last, last video from this home. But I wanted to take the time to shout someone out myself. I have a second channel. It's called Pokey, uh, not, uh, what, who? It's called Dacosity Pocket because all I play there is Pokemon TCG Pocket. For those who don't know, that is Pokemon trading card game Pocket. It is a smaller version of the trading card game, more kind of streamlined, right? There's no energy cards in the deck, so there are only 20 card decks. You know what? Let me show you what a game looks like and even explain it to you. And make sure you go subscribe to Dacosity Pocket if you would like to watch me play that game every single day, because I've been, I've been pretty consistent with that, actually, surprisingly. I know, I did. Dacosity being consistent, that's crazy, right? I, so, so wild. So as you can see, I have this game. It's on the phone, obviously. It's a mobile. You can also kind of get, you know, like one of those emulators. That's how I'm playing it right now using my computer. But you just make an account. Uh, you get free packs every single day, right? You can just open these things. I, I don't think I have one right now to open. Yeah, I need like gold. Ah, you know what? Let's open one right now. So you get these like every day. So I, I think you get like two or three every day, or maybe it's like one every day. I don't know. You, you, you get a decent amount of packs for free to play players. Um, yeah, you just do this. Oh, wow. I just pulled a Pikachu EX. I could use that to make money. Well, not money, but uh, really special tokens and stuff. Look, it plays a little cool animation and everything. Look at that. Oh my God, the Ponytas. Oh, it's so cute. Oh my God. Oh, look at the, oh, look at the little thingies. Oh, yes. Yes, of course. Politoed or Wed or I don't know. I forget their names. Yep, there it is. There's the animation. Was not expecting this to happen. But yeah, there's a lot of love clearly put into this game. I really like it. So that's why I've been, I made a whole channel about it, obviously. I didn't think card games really fit the style of this OG channel. So, you know, that's why it's not being uploaded here <laughs> would be nice because i would be making money off of it but you know I, i'm gonna try uh playing planet coaster 2 on here we're gonna see how that works because i've been loving that but anyway back to explaining pokemon pocket so you know what i'm just gonna walk you through a game right this is versus a real player you can verse uh ai's too there is a solo kind of like a bunch of different solo channel challenges and stuff you could do if you don't want to verse real people to be honest, most people people who play this game aren't very good, so don't be scared. You'll learn quick. It's not very uh, hard. So you always have a basic Pokemon in your hand. You start with five cards. The basic Pokemon you just place down on the board. You have a bench of three, right? There's one active slot and then the bench. So then you reveal whoever uh, won the coin flip gets to go first. Uh, I'm going second here. So the first player can't evolve immediately. They also can't put an energy down, but they obviously get the first draw. Um, and they will actually be the first to evolve. So like, I can't, if I had something to evolve here on the, on the, you know, in the zone, I couldn't because it needs to be on the bench for a turn or on the active zone for a turn before it evolves, right? So if I had a Ralts down there and I had the pre-evolution before Gardevoir, I couldn't evolve it right now. But since I went second, I get energy so first player generally wants like if they need to evolve something they want to go first right uh if you want need more energy because you will have just naturally one more energy than the opponent uh on curve you want to go second right mewtwo decks definitely want to go second right um let's see here let's this to try and draw more cards here and uh Great, I didn't draw a single Ralts, but I drew everything else. So th this is a supporter card. Um, you can only play one of these per turn. And this X speed is a item card. You can use as many as these as you can per turn. Every card can only be used twice in a deck. I mean, you, I guess you can use it more than once if you can somehow get it out of the discard zone, but I don't think there's even effects like that. But there's only two cards per, of like each thing per deck is what I'm trying to say. Of course, he red cards me. Why? Would, okay, so this is awesome card called red card where you can just shuffle someone's hand into their deck. Oh, that's great. At least actually that's a Ralts. That's fine. Whatever. Yep. Oh, I found one. All right. Well, just, you know, just give me everything I don't need. That's fine. <laughs> so, yeah. So the strategy with this deck in particular is to just get Mewtwo out 
Ralts is really good for ramping. So on the bench, if you evolve it to Gardevoir, it can always put an extra energy on the Mewtwo. And Mewtwo likes energy because his super move, Side Drive, is four energy and it removes two when you use it. But it does 150, which nukes everything, right? And so the goal, I should have explained this at the beginning, the goal of the game is to kill three Pokemon from the opponent. Now, it's more so to get three points. Now, if you get three points, you win. Every Pokemon taken out by the enemy team is a point, right? Or, and EX Pokemon, like this Articuno, like my Mewtwo, are two points. So if you take these out, you're basically one away from winning. Um, another way to win is to basically, uh, I'm drawing a blank here. If you're, there's only one Pokemon left on the enemy's uh, side, you win if you kill it, right? Because then they have nothing else to play. I don't know what else to do there. Oh god, I hope he doesn't Sabrina me. I could Giovanni here and get rid of it. Yep, he's Sabrina. Oh, hey, Bay. You know what? Kill this. Kill this. I dare you. Kill it. Kill the Corellia or whatever. Do it. Kill it. Yes. Be cool. I have Giovanni. The scary part here is if he has Giovanni again, I will die to uh, a blizzard. Ooh, wait, 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 Sabrina. Nice. Here we go. So yeah, this is just the gist of it. These games generally, at most, take like 10 minutes. Um, you know, it's a pretty, for a card game, it's pretty fast paced. Uh, some games can end in literally like two, two, three turns. Because either the person will concede because it's like obvious they're gonna lose, or they kind of got a bad draw, or maybe didn't put enough Pokemon out and you just wipe their whole board. He's gonna Giovanni and just kill me, right? gonna Giovanni and just kill me, right? I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose for the YouTube video thing that I use to promote my channel. That's that's what's gonna happen here, right? He conceded! Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, that that's that's pretty much the game, right? If you wanna see me play that, play, I you know, I, I try to play a different deck every single day. I try to make them, I mean, the videos very, you know, just me talking, right? It, it's very chill deckosity content. These videos take me like an hour to make, right? Well, most of it's just me recording for 45 minutes and then the editing's incredibly easy. So I've been able to pump these out very, very, very consistently. So, you know, if you want to see just gaming content for me involving this card game, it's, you know, like a walk in the park for me, especially when they add more and more cards. Because right now, like, the making decks is kind of stale in a way. Like, there's enough, there's enough to where there's plenty of variety. I, I actually enjoyed deck building a lot, as you can see. I have just, I have 15 decks already made. I mean, I guess I gotta get rid of the Sand Slash one that, that came with the game. But, like, I, I've made so many. Uh, it, it's and I'm, I already have more planned, right? I, I haven't even scratched the surface here, but it, there's still only like 200 cards. Um, obviously, it's like an official Pokemon game, so it will have a long lifespan. It will be supported. Uh, it's gotten nothing but praise. Also, here's this Wonder Pick. Th th this is a cool feature. So um, right now, there's a Chansey Pick that's free. You get these like Wonder Pick tokens, and you can actually pick. Uh, cards from someone else's pack that they drew and yeah as you can see it does this thing and then yada 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 bing bam boom you pick a random card i'm gonna hope kabuto didn't get it i still am looking for a kabuto i have like 1500 cards right well we'll see the number down here uh 1438 cards and i have not found this thing a kabuto and i would have liked to find the japanese one because that would have been really funny to have but yeah, that's the gist of it. Just, you know, like and subscribe. Go check out that channel. Only subscribe to that channel uh, if you're interested in the Pokemon game, right? I, I don't want a bunch of random people who, you know, are just subbing to make me feel good. I don't care about the number going up. I want people who generally want to watch all of the content, right? I, I want, like, I want to make the algorithm basically know, like, hey, this person likes the Pokemon game. This person likes the card game. Or even just likes watching Dacosity. You know, I, I want the algorithm to get a little boost from my very, very small fan base that I have here, right? 
but I don't want, I don't want, you know, random people who, like me, but aren't gonna watch the card game, right? You know, and I don't blame you too, you're not obligated to, but obviously just know if you just go sub to it and do nothing, I'd rather you just not sub because that's gonna kind of hurt the algorithm. Not ridiculously, right? Um, but it's, you know, it's not, it's not good. It's not necessarily actually helping me. It might even be hindering me in a way. So uh, just, just letting you know, content brain over here running full maximum overtime. Anyway, I love you guys. More better videos very soon, and I'll see you in the next one. I'm gonna go take a piss. <laughs>